To start Vim, just type V-I-M, Vim. Let's do it. Vim has the special modes. One of them is the insert mode, in which you can type your text, and the other one is the command mode. Most of, of commands are some letters or numbers. To enter the insert mode, just type a letter I. Let's do it. Check out this information sign in the left bottom corner. It says insert. It means that you are in insert mode. Now you can type your text here. Let's type some text and then we'll have to switch to the command mode to save the file. You can type here whatever you want. Let me also type some text. And now we have to leave the, the insert mode to go to the command mode. To do this, you just press escape key. Let's do it. Press escape. See, the word insert in the left bottom corner has disappeared. Now we are in the command mode. To give some command to Vim editor, just type colon and after colon you can give any commands. Let's type a command. In our case we want to write the file, so we type W. Then we press space and uh, give it a name. I, I'll name it text1. We can see the notification that our file is written and its name is text1. Now if we finished editing and creating a file, we can quit Vim by pressing colon again and Q letter. Now, to move around the file, you can use the letters. J is the letter to go down. Let's press it sometimes, some several times. So let's press J. As you can see, the cursor goes down. J is for down. K is for up, so let's press it several times. Just press K, as you can see, the cursor goes up. L is for right, so let's press it several times. Uh, and uh, as you can see, when we press L letter, it goes right. Let's do it, let's press it several times. Just press L se several times. And H is for left, so press several times H and the cursor will go left. As you can see, it is moving left when we press H button. Let's practice it a bit more. Let's press J to move, to move down. Press K to move up. Press L to move right and press H to move left. Now let's press I to add some text. Let's type some text here. Press escape and type WQ to save the changes to the file. Let's give it a name as it is a new file. Let's name it text2.txt and leave. Now let's recap the commands we used in Vim editor, our first commands. So to enter Vim editor you just type Vim. If you want to edit some already existing file just type Vim and the name of the file. Now by default Vim goes in command mode. To enter the insert mode, you just press I. This will show that uh, you use insert mode. Now you can add some text to your file. To go back to the command mode again, just pre press escape. To move around your text, just press J to move down, K to move up, L to move right, and H to move left. To write the changes to the file, go to the command mode by pressing escape 
and type write, then the file's name. If you want to write the changes to an existing file, just type write and put an exclamation mark. And to, to quit, you just write in command mode Q letter.